Hey Filmmaker Shung here. In this video, we're going to show you how to make a comic text box like the ones you see inside of Post Malone Sunflower for uh, the Spider-Verse music video. And this is a nice text box to make and this is entirely done inside of Premiere Pro. So we're going to make a color mat or yeah, basically a color mat. Go to new item, go to color mat. This you can make in any color that you want, doesn't really matter because it needs to go through a lot of process and actually in the end it will be something else. So we drag this color mat onto the timeline here and we are going to effects. We are going to first go to video effects, going to generate and there we're going to grab cell pattern. This we're going to drop onto the color mat and you see this cell pattern happening. We are going to effects control. We're going to change this cell pattern, the disperse to zero. So this is a nice lined uh, bubbles. And we are going to change the size to 15. So we have small dots instead. And we are going to make it very contrasty. So it's like um, 1500 should be fine. And we are going to rotate this and rotate this 20 degrees and actually minus 20 degrees. And we are going to use the mask here at opacity and going to rotate this so that it's straight instead of in an angle and should be fine. And we're going to move this, oh, move this to here where we want it to be. And we are going to grab another effect called tint. So type in here T I N T and put this also onto the color mat. Now we are going to change the color here. And we can either change both the colors, the black to another color and the white to another color. But I think uh, just changing the black should be fine. Choose like an orangey color here. That should be nice. Uh, actually go to the mask here. There's a feathering. We're going to close that. So it's now more without any feathering going on. Now going to under the pen tool, grab the rectangle tool and we're going to draw a rectangle around here. Make sure it's all the way covering the box. And now we're going to move this graphic behind the color mat. Now we can actually adjust this so it's a nicer box around it. Doesn't need to be perfect. And now we go into the effects control, change this from a gray to a black box. So change it to black. Okay. And then we are going to add a drop down shadow. Make this 100%. Make the shadow actually also be black. And we're going to remove this feathering here. And we're going to make this more further standing out. And it might be less visible. I'm going to add a color mat here behind it so it's more visible. And we're going to change the degree from here to here. So it should already look like the text box that you see inside of the music video. Now we're going to type uh, anywhere on the screen. Wait for the save project. Okay, now we're going to press the T on your keyboard or press the type tool here. And we're going to press anywhere onto the screen and we're going to type in comic text box. So I actually already have like a comic font here installed called comic panels. So you can find that font online and use that and put that in here. So you now, when I remove this, we have like a nice text box, uh, like a comic text box next to the figure. And yeah, basically this is how to make the comic text box that you see inside of the Post Malone 
a sunflower music video. So I hope you guys found this a very interesting video. If you want to see more upcoming videos like this, please hit that subscribe button here below. Also make sure to hit that bell icon so you're always updated when I post a new video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.